good morning everybody today we are going to see revision okay revision for unit number 1 our subject environmental science okay we are going to start the d words okay should know all d words in your class book okay totally you have 20 d words in your class book you should know all the 20 d words in your class book okay children i will revise for the chat okay children you should know all the spelling of it and your portion for lesson number 1 Lesson number two. Okay, shall we start with the words, children? See, first one, a, a, i, or a. What is the first one spelling? A, a, i, or a. Second one, water, w, a, t, e, or water. What is the spelling for water? W, a. Water. Third one, plants. Okay, third one, plants. P L G G T X. Plants. What is the spelling for plants, children? P L G G T X. Plants. Fourth one.
living. Okay? You all know that living things only can go. Isn't it children? So the answer is living. So put your tick mark on living. By saying the spelling of living, you can write by asking this in this black box. Okay children? What is the spelling for living? You are given here L I V I N G living. Okay? Only living things can grow. Isn't it? Only living things cannot grow. As I said, we already have the class of book living things. Isn't it children? What are living things? Human beings, plants, animals, birds. Isn't it? These are all living things. They can only grow. Isn't it? So, living things can grow. Next, second one. Things made by man or called dash things. See, I'm repeating the question again, children. See, things made by man or called dash things. Okay, made by man, man made or not, children. The question itself we can easily understand this. See, things made by man or called man made things. Cotton from dash plant. 
or man made see the question itself you can easily say and water soil mountain and all are natural things there are all what children there are all natural things isn't it see natural and a g u o a l natural there are all natural things okay children what we have discussed now we have discussed choose the correct answer isn't it see living things can grow things made by man are called man made things the sun is natural a child is man made environment means everything in the world around us trees or homes of animals homes for animals the root remains under the ground leaves prepares food for the plants lotus is an aquatic plant we get cotton from cotton plants and water soil home child rain rivers and clouds are natural things so we have discussed about choosing the correct answer now we are going to move to the next exercise okay children take the correct sentence cross the wrong part okay you have to read the statement if it is correct you have to put your tick in the given box and if it is a wrong statement means you have to put your wrong in the given box okay children shall we start to see first one first one okay natural things are also made by man see i am repeating the question again children see natural things are also made by man this natural thing is made by man children no it is not made by man isn't it things that are made by man are called man made things and things that directly come from nature are known as natural things isn't it but it is a wrong statement so you have to put here wrong mark and the given box it is a wrong statement okay children second one not living things can reproduce non living things can reproduce children it is a wrong isn't it only living things can reproduce it is also a wrong statement so you have to put here wrong mark in the given box okay shall we go to the third one children see shampoo and lotion or man made things yes we are using shampoos and lotions isn't it there are what there are man made things it is a correct sentence isn't it shampoo and lotion or man made things we have to put here tick mark and age okay because it is a correct statement and then fourth one plants or not useful plants or not useful is it correct children it is a wrong because plants are used for us in many ways isn't it they give us fruits vegetables spices cereals spices many more things they are giving isn't it so plants are very much useful for the, for us it is a wrong statement so you have to put here wrong not an a and then first one we get oil from sunflower we get oil from sunflower yes it is a correct statement children so you have to put here tick mark an a okay sixth one some animals eat plants some animals eat plants yes some of the animals eat plants like cow horse isn't it they will eat plants isn't it so it is a correct statement so you have to put tick mark an a okay and then seventh one leaves make food for plants leaves make food for plants this we have already saw in the choose the correct answer isn't it the children leaf only prepares food for the plants that we have studied in the choose yes it is a correct statement leaf only prepares food for plants so we have to put here tick mark and age okay and then a plant cannot move or get warm a plant cannot move on their own yes a plant cannot move on their own it is a correct statement so you have to put here tick mark and a okay children see natural things are also made by man it is wrong non living things can be produced it is also a wrong statement shampoos and lotion are man made things it is a correct plants are not useful it is wrong we get oil from sunflower yes it is a correct statement some animals eat plants as it is a correct leaves make food for plants it is also a correct a 
plan cannot move on their own in the jokes, eh? correct statement of children, totally we have changing the correct sentence from pros and onwards children, we have to refer your book calls for each children, just like when we are only age, you have to read all the day, take the correct sentence in your book, okay, shall we go to the book exercise next exercise children, see, look at the picture and write whether it is a living thing or a non-living thing, you have to look at the picture, if it is a living thing, you have to write it as a living thing. If it is a non-living thing, you have to write it as a non-living thing. Okay, children, what is the first picture given here? It is a tomato, isn't it? Isn't it? So it is a living or non-living thing, children. It is a living thing, isn't it? It is a living thing. Okay, if you don't know, so if you don't know the spelling for living things, you can refer to the heading and you can write it. Okay? But you must know the spelling for all these things because we have studied this in detail itself, isn't it? Isn't it, children? Okay, living thing. So you have to write living thing here. The living thing L I B I N G. Living thing. T H I N G. Living thing. Okay. What is the second feature? See, it is a stone. What it is? It is a stone. So it is a living thing or non-living thing, children? It is a non-living thing, isn't it? Because it cannot move, it cannot grow. So we are saying this is a non-living thing. So you have to write non-living thing here. And go and non-living. L-I-B-I-N-G. Non-living thing. T-H-I-N-G. Non-living thing. Okay. Shall we go to the third picture? What it is? It is a flower. Isn't it? Flower is a living thing. Isn't it? Flower is a Living things. So you have to write living thing here. L I B I N G. Living thing. T H I N G. Living thing. And then shall we go to the next picture? See what it is. It is a plant, isn't it? It is a plant. It is also a living thing, children. Okay. You have to write living thing here again. L I B I N G. Living thing. T H I N G living thing. See what is the next picture, children? It is a kite, isn't it? It is it a living thing, children? No, isn't it? It is a non living thing. So you have to write non living thing here, okay? N O N non living L I B I N G non living thing. D H I N G non living thing. Last one is what it is? It is a call, isn't it? It is a call. It is also a non living thing. So you have to write non living thing here. Okay, children? We have to look at a picture. We have to find out the correct answer. We have to write that it is a living thing or non living thing. Okay, children, shall we go to the next exercise? Children, match the following here. Questions are given, okay? You have to find the correct answer here and you have to match the correct answer. Okay, children, shall we see first one? We should water plants, okay? We should water plants. That is the correct answer. Yes, here it is, see? Regularly. We should water plants regularly, okay? You have to match the first one to here regularly, okay? See, next, second one. Aquatic. Plants. What is again one? Aquatic plants. Aquatic plants always grow in water, isn't it? So the answer for aquatic plants here it is. Grow in water. So you have to match this again one aquatic plants to grow in water. The third one is desert plants. Okay? Desert plants always have thick stem. Desert plants always have thick stem. So here the answer, a match that has a plan to have thick stem. Next fourth one is leaves. What it is? Leaves. Leaves are always green in color, isn't it? Leaves are green in color. So we have to match leaves to green in color. And then fifth one, trees. What it is? Trees. Trees give shelter, isn't it? Please give shelter. Okay. Shall we go to the sixth one, children? What it is? Birds. What it is? Birds. 
birds fly, isn't it? Birds fly. So you have to match birds to fly. And then shampoos. Shampoos are man-made, isn't it, children? Shampoos are man-made thing. Next, clay. Clay is here. Yeah? What? Clay is here. Yeah? Natural resource, isn't it? Clay, natural resource. You have to match clay to natural resource. Next, living things. Living things reproduce, isn't it? Living things reproduce. Match living things to reproduce. And then non-living things cannot move. Okay? Non-living things cannot move. Okay, children, I repeat it again. See? We should water plants regularly. Aquatic plants go in water. Desert plants have thick stem, leaves are green in color. Trees give shelter. Birds fly. Shampoos, man-made, clay, natural resource, living thing, reproduce, non-living thing, cannot move. Okay, children, you have to find the correct answer. You have to match it correctly. Okay, next, we are going to move to question and answer. Okay? There are five question and answers totally in your class of children from lesson 1 and lesson 2. You have to read all the five question and answers. Okay? Here you have written only four. You have to read all the five question and answers in your class. Okay? Shall we revise the first one, children? See? Name any two natural things that you see every day in your Android. Okay? Name any two natural things that you see every day in your Android. And the answer water and soil. Water, W A G E or water, and A N D and soil, S O I L, soil. Next, again, one. Write the parts of your plant. Again, one. Write the parts of your plant. The parts of a plant are what? Root, stem, leaf, flower, and fruits. Okay? Root or O O T root, stem S T E M stem, leaf L E A F leaf, flower F L O W E of flower, fruits F O U I G S fruits. Okay, children. See root, stem, leaf, flower and fruits. Third one, write two names of the medicinal plant. Write two names of the medicinal plant. Answer, name and tulasi. Answer, name and tulasi. N-E-E-M, name, A-N-G, and tulasi, T-H-U-L-A-S-I. Tulasi, next. Fourth one, write the uses of the plants. Answer, plants give us vegetables, Fruits, drinks, and homes for many animals. Okay, you should know the spelling for vegetables. Okay, B E G E G A D L E S vegetables. Fruits, F R U I G S fruits. Drinks, G R E I N S drinks. And homes, H O M E S homes for many animals. A N I M A L E S animals. Okay, children. Plants you ask. Vegetables, fruits, grains, and homes for many animals. Okay, children, we have various questions now. Okay, children. Now we are going to see parts of your plant. Okay, here there are various parts. Okay, we are going to mark out the parts here. Okay, children, what is the first one here? Flower. Isn't it? So we have to write the spelling for flower. And we have to write here. What is the spelling for flower? F L O W E R flower. Okay? And next one, what it is? It is a yeah, stem, isn't it? It is above the ground. We have to write stem here. S G E M. Stem. And what it is? It is a yeah, fruit, isn't it? We have to write fruit. F or U I T. Fruit. 
mark the all the parts of your plant, isn't it? Flower, stem, fruit, leaf, and root. Okay, children. You have to revise all the book exercise and also worksheets in your book. It is from lesson number one and lesson number two. You have to read all the book exercises, which means by choose, match, take the correct. Sentence, cross the long ones, and you have to read all the worksheets from lesson one and lesson two. Okay, children, write the exam properly and send in the WhatsApp group. Thank you, children. All the best.